So over here, I am signed in and I am in the home page of Microsoft Forms. And over here, I don't have any forms created. So if you have any forms created, then you'll see it over here in the recent or in the My Forms section right here. But in my case, uh, this is a fresh start. So I need to start creating a new form. And in order to create a new form, on the top left hand side, you can see that new form button is an option. So if you were to go around and click right here, then what happens is that a new form is created. A new form is loaded out as you can see right here. And now over here on the right hand side, you got different presets that you can choose from, templates that you can choose from. But let me just go around and stick to the default one right now. And in order to start creating this form, you need to add in a title to the form and add in description as well. So over here, you can see that untitled form uh, is written. And if I were to go around and click it like this, you can see that I can simply go around and uh, type in the uh, title of the form as I like. So I can go around over here and say, let's say, for example, tutor tube example form right here just like this so you can see that that is the title and if i were to click outside you can see that um now the form uh title has been changed similarly i can go around over here and click on the title and here i can add in a description to the form as well so over here i'm going to say this is an example form that i am creating for a tutorial series learning uh not learning but uh, let's say tutorial series Microsoft forms uh, Microsoft forms Tutorial series right here. Just like this. I'm just going to go around and say this is an example form that I'm creating for a tutorial series Called Microsoft forms tutorial series just like this and if I were to click outside now You can see the title right here and the description as well if I were to go around over here and select out the uh, title right here, you can see that I can also go around and format out the titles according to how I want. Let's say, for example, I can bold this out, I can italicize it, I can underline it, and I can go around and choose a color for this as well. So the selected text, as you can see, changes out. I can go around and make it, let's say, medium right over here as well. And if I were to click outside, the text size right here changes out to medium. So if I were to select it, I can make it small and the, the size becomes small right here, just like this. So that is what you have. And let me just go around and select this out right here and then make everything large right here. And you can see that the selected text is larger. So let me just go around and select out everything right here. Let me just select the tutor tube and then make it large. And then for the example form, I'm going to go around and make it small right here. Similarly, for the description as well, you can go around and select out, let's say, Microsoft Forms tutorial series. And then you can go around, choose out a color for it, and then choose, let's say, large, medium, and small. So let me just go around and make this large while uh, the others right here remain as it is. So click outside, and this is what you have, as you can see. So you can go around and then turn it into points as well. For example, I'm going to go around and press enter and say in this tutorial series, you will learn uh, just like this, how to make forms, um, manage forms, and then let's say, for example, uh, conduct surveys right here. So if you want to turn it into points, you can select these out right here and select one, two, three to make a numbered list right here, just like this. Press enter to add in more numbers as well. And you can also go around and turn it into points. And this is what you have. And this is how you can go around and create out new forms and then add in titles and descriptions and even format them inside of Microsoft Forms while creating new forms. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.